Hey guys, it's Eric here, and I'm back with another YouTube video. And today we're gonna to be doing something that I've already done before. Actually, I actually done before on my YouTube channel, but I actually delete the video. And for one reason is, well, I don't want to say this, but um, is to get more fame and more views from this and likes from this. Because last one was, um, it was all the way back in August. Like I think it was like late August. Um, it was like almost a year ago. I'm surprised how freaky this year has went. Um, especially 2023, but 2022 as well. But uh, the reason why I'm doing this video is just to remake. And I've realized that the website, they actually updated and changed it a little bit. Uh, I don't know why. I guess they kind of wanted to. Maybe they found other things on Google Maps that kind of interested them rather than the ones that they didn't want to mention. Like, for example, I'll, I'll get to it in the video. But the main reason why I'm doing this is just because it's an update a bit. Um, this is kind of like the remastered version a bit. I actually did really well in the last recording. And also, this one's going to be edited a bit as well. Unlike the last one, so. And, um, yeah, we're going to look at the t top 25 weirdest places according to this website called Tech Advisor. I think you guys should already know what the website is. I'll give you guys a link to it, though. Um, sorry about that. Mm, sorry about that. It's kind of a bit of mucus. But I'll give you guys a link to it in the description. So this number one's a speed demon. So um so they censored a license license plate for privacy reasons and thirty seven in a thirty miles per hour speed zone. So this is like looks like in England. And I think it's kinda interesting to see Google Maps record this. It's a, and it's in St. George's Road. I don't think you guys need to know that, but it's somewhere around England. I remember viewing this actually. There's they actually give you a link to it, which um, which is cool. Um, this one's Japes and Ladders. Uh, it's like that game Snakes and Ladders. So, but this time it's Japes and Ladders. So, so the family that stands on ladders and pours water over each other's heads. This one's weird. Uh, I assume this one's in America because of the houses and how the neighborhood's designed. Oh, this one's actually really good. Like, Life Imitates Art. This is somewhere... Uh, I don't know where this is. Actually... But, um, yeah, it looks like a mirror, basically, from that. Like, you, you can tell this artist is definitely, like, like highly talented when it comes to this. Um, there's a bit of a glitch right there. Um, Google Maps always does this. And, in fact, the website even falls for this. They just put that on, on there. But the good news, they didn't on this one. Um, this is the fairy tale in Uxbridge. It looks like there's some guy um, taking a photo of the... Cinderella's carriage. Um, going to, yeah, it's at, it's from Disney. I think where she. I haven't really watched that movie in a while, and I don't really feel like. I don't know. It, it, it's not the best. Um, but I haven't watched that movie in years. The Cinderella movie. I think she was going to the ball with that. Uh, maybe wrong here. So it's like in England. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna move on. Uh, this one's just a rainbow. So I don't really get this one, but maybe the description will help. Full rainbows captured on Google Street View near Dartmoor National Park here in the UK, as well as the shadow view of the Street View camera. So this one's, I don't really get why this one's on here. They should have removed this one. Oh yeah, I think they replaced number two, the Japes and Ladders, with the, it used to be the Bat Cave. I guess they kind of, either Street View removed it or... Um, this website really wasn't interested. Um, so I'm inspired by Jack Sucks at Life and Corana Burger for um, this video. Um, as I said in the last one, but I deleted it. Uh, I'll give you a link to their channels and probably their original videos too. Um, Coastal Split. Uh, this one is about a, uh, English yoga lady doing yoga, a privacy invasion, and all that. This one's not funny. Um, I watched that Corander Burger vid. He didn't really find this funny. And I, I mean, I don't really find it funny either, but, mm, why would you, like, make fun of someone for, like... Their car's falling off. I feel like this is more serious. But it's kind of funny, like, seeing this, how it ended up on Google Maps. So I guess it's kind of funny, but kind of not. Mostly not. Um, got this weird photo of a weird bicycle with his toy imaginary pet penguin on the back. I have no idea what to think about that. This is a scarecrow field. I think this is in, like, Sweden or Finland. It was, like, a Scandinavian country. Uh, basically looks like a graveyard full of scarecrows. This one kind of freaked me out, though. Oh, this one's hilarious. Number 10 is Squid Game. I think it's also Scandinavian. I think it's, like, in Norway, I'm pretty sure. And then these guys, they look like they're playing, like, golf or something. But I don't know why they're wearing these weird zombie biohazardous suits. 
Mm, could be for safety reasons. But it's funny to see how these guys are playing golf in, like, squid game uniforms. It's pretty hilarious. Maybe they, it's. I think it's for just in case if the golf ball gets in the water, they can always retrieve it. But, yeah, it's kind of funny to see this. I want to read the description. It says, nothing to see here, just a couple of squid game players having a relaxing round of golf. Yeah, but this was, like, took in, like, way before squid game existed. I know that. Because squid game existed in, like, October. I can't remember when. Um, the TARDIS, which is from Doctor Who, and never really seen Doctor Who, but it is cool to see this, and actually, I don't know what this is, like, I don't know Doctor Who, so I'm not gonna get this one, so, oh no, this one used to be called the Pigeon People, now it's called the Bird, the Bird's Eye View, um, so, the, I, I wanna comment on this one really bad, cause this one, it's like the most common one of all the weird things that you see on Google Maps. Like this has always got to be on there. It's also in like a. It was actually once on an Ohio meme, actually, believe it or not. And I don't like the Ohio meme. Um, but yeah, this this is probably one of the first Google Maps preview images I've seen, like since I, when I was five. Um, but yeah, um, the Stockholm syndrome. So they censored a lot compared to. Don't know if they censored more than before, but I feel like they censored more. Um, these Swedes are thrown shade at the Google Street View. So a few camera car. Oh, okay, this one's Iceland Tea. I know it says Alfreso Lunch, but whatever. I prefer to call it that. It used to be called that, but I prefer the old title, though. If you get a bit chilly in Iceland, so if you're going to have a spot of tea and cake, then you best dress up warm. Because, you know, in Iceland, uh, Scandinavian country, a um, bit south near Greenland, Really cold, I'll have to say, because I don't know much about Iceland. And believe it or not, I think it was the country that was like $12 for one grape. Or was that Japan? I don't know. It was like a, from a Nas Daily video. Oh, wait, no. I think you have to pay to breathe a jar of air. It's pretty hilarious. A Nas Daily video on this one. This one kind of scared me. I remember seeing this when I was little. The um, Galap Galapagos Street View. It really isn't a street view. It's more like a, a rock view or a nature view, I guess. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to move on. Um, skiing on grass. Now, this one's, ooh, this one's in, like, Europe, um, in Mount Blanc. So this guy, eh, he's just having the time of his life doing, trying to do a YouTube challenge here. Because YouTube still exists in 2015, 2013, I can't see. But, um, but this guy just trying to do a challenge and trying to test it out. Does it work on grass? Yeah. It's near the Alps, though. I think it's Switzerland. Um. Dentistry on the move. It's in Pakistan. We know it's in Bangladesh. Uh, I thought it was Pakistan, but um, really not that impressive. I guess it kind of got captured. It was. I mean, some these things just happen randomly. Like, like every. I assume like every Google Maps car or most Google Maps cars don't even expect this stuff to happen, but it just does. For some odd reason, though, humans out of the water. These scuba divers, they're chasing after the car because they got caught, because they, they got, um, the Google map cars were a bit spying on them, and then they, they kind of got photobombed, so, um, yeah, they're going after them. They're mad. Um, bow and arrow. Um, this one's kind of, um, so this one's kind of cool. It's a bit dangerous, too. I wouldn't recommend that. Um, but yeah, I'm going to move on. Six times a man. This is either a glitch, or maybe it's like a whole squad, or... It's either a glitch or there are six different people. It's like a whole squad. They all look similar. Uh, you see that a lot in Asia where the, like it's like one of those um, Norwegian reindeer. Um, so I think some people in Norway actually believe that there's Santa that lives around there. I don't know. Um, so that's what Scandinavian countries believe. Most of these are from Scandinavia or England. That's weird. Um, but yeah. Um, horse eating a banana. Now this one was in... Um, Jack sucks at life's thumbnail on the Google Maps. So it's in British Columbia. Actually, it took me forever to look for this address. I actually searched that address up, and boom, I found it. I thought it was like 1240 Liberty Drive in Victoria, British Columbia. So it's a Canadian one. It's cool. Uh, I don't know anything about the steak. It's it's a BBC show. I, I never watched it. Uh, don't get mad at me. You prob Probably most of you all never watch it, too, so... So I was recording in Scotland, and 24 is a sea creature. Someone was doing a prank, and um, for some reason, the Google car just kind of eavesdropped and swept in. And uh, yeah, boom, you get this photo. I don't know how he or she felt after this. And this one's a pretty hilarious one. The chick, 
I should say the privacy cow because they censored the cow's face because he was special. He was either, it's either that or they kind of mistake him for a person or it's a Chick-fil-A cow or the farmer kind of, I don't know, it's for privacy reasons. But yeah, it's kind of hilarious how they censored the cow. They you usually only do that to humans, but I guess this does, I guess it applies differently with this. And it's like, uh, it doesn't tell you the location. So yeah, that was a quick update video. I mean, not really much has changed. They only changed the titles. I think a couple were like added. But I think most of it, yeah, I remembered having most of these. Yeah, most of these. Uh, yeah, I think, I think there was like one or two. I can't remember. But uh, yeah, I'm not going to look for it. But yeah, so that was an update video on and an not a remastered, but an update video on uh, Google weirdest places on Google Street View, Google Maps, aka or Google Earth, by Tech Advisor. So um, yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed the video. Anyways, uh, Juliet, and bye bye, out and peace.